Our company has more than doubled in the last five years. Dell Cam is still making it easier for us to make parts around here. Everybody wants everything faster. I think that's a big part of making JR's growth what it is today. At JR Automation here, we use Feature Cam for all of our CNC programming needs. Um, we've been using it for a little over a year now. Five years ago, I was machinist, and now I'm machining lead. Feature Cam is continually getting better. We've almost doubled in the amount of machinists as well as almost doubled in the amount of seats of feature cam in the last five years. Dell Cam's helped us expand our business because it's been affordable and we've purchased power mills since then too which with some of the new five axis machines we've got in it helped us really use that machine to its fullest capability. We looked at surf cam, master cam and they just weren't as user friendly. We switched over from Pro Engineer, their CNC software, and we found a lot of benefits with that. We're allowing the operators to actually program on the floor at the console. That gives them a lot more accountability and it allows them to see what's happening in the designs and double check that against the, the actual 2D drawings that they have received. We have a five axis Herco that we purchased about two years ago. We have a couple other Herco machines we purchased. We've just purchased some Mazak machines and we have two Fanuc robo drills that we've just purchased recently that we're integrating into our system. Power mill allows us to be very picky about our programs. It's very, very strong in allowing us to edit our programs and get the exact tool pass we would like. Every now and then you'll have data that's not quite right and you're not getting a very smooth finish. That's all stuff that's very editable in PowerMill. I think it gave me a good opportunity to show how good I really am. It helped me progress and be a better machinist. It's very easy to keep multiple machines going and stay ahead of our workload, which seems to be ever-growing.